Alright, so apparently I forgot to adjust my um, saving settings, so that last bit got a bit cut off. But... <laughs> this is what this game does to you. It draws you in. It makes you forget time and stuff. And come on! Here you go! Majestic! So I was only planning to get to um, the end of this section right section here where they're getting out of these caves. But so um, this section may be a bit shorter than intended. But seriously it's I, I love it! Look at Chico. <laughs> Body shaking. An easy way to get rid of water and hanging boys. Falls over so much. Yeah, that feeling when you walk outside and it's a sunny day. Yeah, that is the boy. Yeah, good to you, Lee. Yeah, no, the erote. How are you? Yeah, I got the other. You can hear him crying. tower there. I think the mirror room was underneath it. Aratuzi, Otetara Lastuzi, Ara Castacaru, Inokia, Ata Dudo Kutuzi, Yanomot Katunek, Aokuzi. Looking all around, looking at the birds, everything. So, given the amount of distance that you cover, um, maybe you weren't in the basement of that thing, but you're definitely in a section of it because it's the only place that's made out of that material. The level of nope in some of these chapters is incredibly high. This is on the low end.
Yeah, Trico. Trico over here. Come on, boy. You can do it. turn the camera to see what Truco's doing, you can still tell pretty well what he's up to since his shadow is cast like directly on you. And that's all this ambient sound effect, it actually sounds like there's, like he's right behind me. <laughs> That's what I'm- Whoa. You okay, buddy? Need to lay off the Twinkies. I kid. I kid. He looks like he's a very healthy weight, actually. Give him that cat-like... Yeah. And since cats, when they're a healthy weight, tend to be a bit leaner than other animals. Actually, a lot of wild animals look lean when they're at a healthy weight. I'd have to double check to see which ones um, they are, but I think that's a general rule of thumb. Do the thing. Oh. If I could get to the end without dying once, that would be awesome. I don't think I will, but it'd be cool. Come on, boy. You can do it. Since the Chicos can actually um, fly, it's quite possible that his bone, that he isn't as heavy as he looks. Do you want face scratches? Face scratches? No? Yes? <laughs> and here's actually where you start getting the collared achievement. Because you have for that you have to get Trico to poke his head through every single hole that he can stick his head through. Sad. Like, I want to follow. I want to. But... <laughs> Sorry, but for the achievement. For the achievement! Look, you look so sad. And it sounds just as sad, too. Why we love him. Butterflies. It's a barrel. A barrel. It's it. Do -do -do. Oh, 
Ona li aututu keo no nita ago kuzi adu tu ku no otazi. Like, I realize he's. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Do you want head screeches? Oh. Ah, you want the barrel. Get it out from under there. And I will pull it out. <laughs> Glad that I've gotten the timing down on that. On that. Face crickets? Oh yeah, you want space scritches. <laughs> actually since I don't have a timer on right now, but I'm probably getting close to a time where we're running out of time, so that was all uh, for now. Auna li, au tutu, keo no nita, ago kuzi, adu tu ku no otaze. But that was the beginning of the last guardian. Next time, join me to do more treacherous jumping and face scratches. So many face scratches. Until then, this is Grimalkin Kids signing out.